Here's the original. It didn't look that bad. <laughs> look how pixelated she looks. Edit in the glitch when you post it to YouTube. <laughs> Relocated now to St. Francis's Folly, new temptations torment me. Rumor amongst the fellow brothers is that entombed beneath our monastery is the body. Okay. Since we already played these, I'm gonna skip. Whoa! This looks really good. Look at the door. Wow, that's what it used to look like. Oh no! No! I forgot about the lions. And we're still in the old school graphics. We're stuck. Okay. Lions got the zoomies. See what it, oh my god, that looks so pretty. Look how nice this is. I feel like everything looks great, and then these blocks look exactly the same. Well, not exactly the same, but I don't know. That's crazy. This is so great, this folly. This game just looks so good, yo. It really does. The pillars look like polished marble now. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. They do. Is this the room with the monkeys? The gorillas? I have nothing! Pistols, that's it. Legs are so skinny. That's funny. Oh, when they stand up, their legs are so skinny. Look at the <laughs> look at the shadow on the ceiling. <laughs> In the world, yo. Ooh. Oh no, that's scary. Why do you have so much health? Oh my god. Gorilla skipping leg day. <laughs> oh my god. That's what it looked like. Like the whole body is like... Like super muscular and then their legs are like super skinny. <laughs> um, Alright, that one's... This one definitely looks like polished marble. That one looks really pretty. Like right here. This is cool. Alright, so that was it for this one, but what the hell did I gain from coming in this room? Anything? I don't really remember doing this before and like what the purpose of this room is. Um but I'm assuming it did something out here. I don't know. Oh crap, this guy. So somebody said that this dude used to have a naked lady on the back of his shirt. Back of his jacket. And um... 
for the remasters, they put a they put a red bra on her. Oh my god, that's funny. Like they really were like, okay, we gotta fix that. <laughs> Um, all right, I gotta bring it this way now. Yeah, those look really cool now that you mentioned that it's marble. Look at the lighting on that one. That's really pretty. The lighting here. And the- no, it's like peeling... It's like peeling paint or something, I don't know. But that still looks really cool. A naked lady, you say? Yeah, on the back of his jacket. Pierre, I think. Where I go? I don't know if I can jump to that, but I'm gonna try. It says, this says Lady Luck above her on his back. Yeah, I saw that earlier. I was watching someone else's stream and they were trying to read it. And, um, that's what it said. Uh, where the hell? Maybe I can jump that way. Oh, crap. I'm sure, like, the old game, you probably couldn't even make out that that's what that said either. But, like, you could definitely see it now in the remaster. Um, I don't think I'm going to be able to make this. I don't remember how I did it the other time. <laughs> yeah, that's too high up. Um, it's just weird because there is like a, one of those things here. I feel like it's gonna close a door if I move that. Uh, yeah, also you couldn't make out her details with the pixelated texture. No wonder they changed it now. Yeah. <laughs> and I don't think anybody thought to, like, like, look around and, like, try to see what was on his jacket or whatever. So they probably, it was probably just somebody that threw it in there. Kind of like, um, the little mermaid. Did you guys hear about the VHS cover of The Little Mermaid, like, back in the day? How somebody, I think, like, somebody was mad they were getting fired that day, and then they they drew something inappropriate and put it in the background of the cover of The Little Mermaid. And um, now, like, anybody who has those, they're worth, like, a lot of money. Because it was, like, for a limited time, it actually made it out, and then somebody realized what it was. Oh my god. But, um, yeah, they say if you were ever to find that VHS tape, there were only, like, a certain amount made before they realized the mistake. It's just funny. <laughs> this looks so much better than what it used to be. <laughs> so nice. Um, I don't know where that's going to bring me, or if I can even come back to this room, but I am going to save it. It's funny. Whoa, oh crap. I have no idea about that one. All I know about is the one with the Lion King cover in the Bikini Woman and the Lion's face forming those images. Oh. Oh! <clears throat> like when when Simba like lays down, it like smells something in the in the dust. I remember that one. But yeah. <laughs> Look up the the controversy with the with the tape. The VHS tape cover for that one. Funny. 
Like there, there are pictures of the original cassette tape or VHS tape somewhere out there. It's just funny because like <laughs> the dude was so mad that he did that, and then I wonder how long it took them to realize. Ooh, this is pretty too. I think I missed a secret in the last room though. I do remember there being like a lot more stuff there. Here comes my favorite levels part. Oh. Yeah, this um this is a really cool area. I always like the music that they use for this too. Ooh, this is really pretty, the texture that they use for the floor. Ooh! I like that they made the tiles, like, falling off, too. That looks so cool. That's nice. I say, if this light lighting doesn't remind you of the catacombs section of Last Revelation, it does to me. Catacombs? What was the catacomb section again? I completely forgot. <laughs> uh, I just saw the OG cover for Little Mermaid. It gave me a good laugh. <laughs> yeah, it's just funny. I wonder if he got sued, though. He probably did. <laughs> oh no. That was close. Uh... Atlas. Let's go back. There we go. Let's see that. Someone is selling a copy for 5k. That's <laughs> that's funny. The one with all the skeletons, and there you have to pull the pillar into that sinking tile. Um, yeah. You're right. It does remind me of that and that area where you're like moving. Um, that area with the big pit, and it's like multi-leveled and you have to bring the wisps to all these different places or whatever it has like a big like a big hit sides oh no you got a trophy if you get hit by the thing <laughs> let me see Where is it? Where's my trophy? Where's my trophy? They said you get a trophy if you get hit by the Thor's hammer. And there's another trophy if you don't get hit by the lightning, but I don't know how to not get hit by the lightning. Uh, let's talk about something more wholesome in Disney animation. Do you guys know about the Jungle Book blue hidden animation? No. What happened with that? Where you get the trident? Oh, yeah, you're right. Like the same... It looks like the same color scheme, too. You don't get hit by the lightning if you jump and dive in the... Oh. Okay. Why didn't I get the trophy for... Wait, hold on. Why didn't I get the Thor trophy? Don't let Velociraptors bite you in Peru. <laughs> you, get a, you get a trophy for that, that's funny. There's a guy who worked on the studio a lot as a hand, and he had a very particular way he scratched his neck and back while talking. So the artist used it as inspiration for a scene with Mowgli and Baloo, and Baloo is scratching his back the same way the guy used to. 
Oh, that's cool. That's cool that they did all that. I think Asana was saying that he took classes to learn animation from... Like, from Disney. Not, like, from actual like Disney, but, like, from their guide of, like, how they teach animation. I thought that was super cool. Because they have, like, a whole strategy in how they do all that, too. To make it look, like, seamless. That stuff is so cool. Yeah, the steps of animation had to be learned. Yeah, that, um, I never even knew they had, like, a whole strategy in how they did that. I thought it was just, like, you know, everybody learns the same way. Ooh, look at the ceiling. That's so cool. What did it, oh. <laughs> I'm like, what did it used to look like? That's so cool. Well, the new one is cool. The old one looks like weird. Got a key, I think. Ooh, look at that. Look, it's a... <laughs> what the hell? They were like, wow. Uh, you know what's crazy? When I was a little kid, I thought Walt, Dis Walt Disney was still alive. Oh, really? I... I just remember my parents telling me he he froze himself or something. And I was always like wondering about that, like what the hell? <laughs> How the hell do I get down from here now? Oh duh, I could just jump the same way I got here. I forgot I did that. It doesn't look like a jump you can make from here. I used to take models from Team Fortress 2 and I had to animate them with my own using these steps. Yeah that that stuff's cool. I always wanted to learn animation, but I did like a few like animations with like words and stuff. But it just took up so much space on my on my computer, even trying to do that. And I was like, this is gonna take me forever to learn. Like it took me like an hour just to do the simple animation that somebody did for like letters, like typography or whatever. But it was still cool. Um, also they used to show his brother Roy. Oh wait, when they would show the little vignettes with him, so I'm like, he's alive, right? Oh. <laughs> yeah, I know what you're talking about, like the little things that they would show. Also they used to show his brother Roy. I can imagine. Well, that theory, he cryogened himself. Yeah, I don't- is that- oh. Oh my god. <laughs> is that even- did he even freeze himself? I don't know. <clears throat> oh god. Okay, so if I dive... Oh crap, I'm diving, but she's walking! Come on! <laughs> Alright, kill me now. Please kill me. Okay, there we go. Now I can try again. Because I want to get that trophy, too. I tried to jump and she freaking started walking. Yay, we did it. Not staying right now. Uh You've been thunderstruck. <laughs> I used to love the the intro to that song. I can't think of it right now because this music is playing, but that guitar part is so good. Uh, 
can't wait for Tomb Raider 3 scene in the... Oh! In the desert for the fighter jet to zoom by so I could legitimately say, oh my god, graphics. <laughs> they don't... I think... No, never mind. I don't know. I feel like I saw a clip of that and it didn't look like stealth bombers anymore. It looked like normal, like, fighter jets. For the remasters. So I don't even know if they use the same thing. Um, it's cool they intentionally kept all the glitches from the original games in this junk dive to avoid the lightning. Is one of them. Oh, yeah, like the the strategies. I thought that was cool too. Like I'm really happy that they they kept that one thing where you like, you know how if you like jump down. And you're grabbing a ledge, but you like let go like a split second before grabbing it, and then it like brings you below to the ledge below it. They kept that in here. I just tried it and it worked. I thought that was cool. Okay. Save it again, because I didn't get hit by lightning, but I probably will this time. <laughs> Oh crap. Did I make it? Did I make it? Yeah, you are really Loki. <laughs> we did it. What did I get though? Okay. They are just keys. Yeah, that's called a fake safe drop. Oh. Yeah, I learned those from someone that I was watching. They do challenge runs. I was like, this is sick. This is so cool. I must include this in my <laughs> in my gameplay. Oh crap. He gone? Okay, good. I think he's gone. You know, I need to save it. <laughs> what the hell is that? Uh, you kind of feel sorry for those who know nothing about the strategy glitches and try avoiding the lightning by simply running around. <laughs> yeah, I would just take the damage all the time. And then I realized like, oh, after you just said that, I was like, that is a better way of doing things. <laughs> it makes it so much easier. Uh, they sound like little squeaky toys when they die. I thought it was your cat playing with something off screen. Oh, no. <laughs> Where is the cat? Oh. <laughs> She's just staring at my husband. Uh, where is... Where are the other switches? I forget. Oh, boss bar. Boss health bar. Did I do this one already? I don't know if I did. Oh no, I didn't. I like the font that they use. That looks really good. <laughs> Where is that one? That's Atlas. Um, I don't know if there's anything above me. Let's check. Just to be sure.
I don't ever know where they are. Oh, there's one. What the hell? This one's invincible? Okay, so... Oh, Neptune is up here. I think that's where I came from. Um... I guess that one's further down then. Uh, check the bats in photo mode. They got two eyes. Oh. <laughs> Look at its teeth and its nose. Do they always die on their backs though? Because I can't see their eyes. Oh. Um, I'm sure there's bats other places. Oh, look at this! I didn't even realize. I could just look around to figure out where the... Okay, there's... <laughs> there's the door I need to find. There's a switch. Yeah, Look, now we can look at his... <laughs> That's his, uh, his jacket. And it used to not have... Like, the lady used to be naked. <laughs> That's funny. Here's more bats. Aww. They all die on their back, though. That sucks. They all die the same exact way. Oh, you could look at them before they- <laughs> Before they spawn! Oh my god. <laughs> That's funny. Aw, they're cute. I was just talking to somebody recently about bats. I was like, they're actually really adorable. I don't know why people are so afraid of them. They do have, uh, you know, they do cause um, pandemics. <laughs> so, I mean, you can be worried about them for that. But they're cute. They're really cute. They're like little, they're like little gerbils. <laughs> oh my god. They be harmless. <laughs> Uh, when they calculate pickups category at the end, they mean all the, the non-enemy drop to in the level. Um, I think it's just any anything that the developers give you, and then I think like when the the enemies die, any of that loot too. I think it all matters. Uh, it's nice they gave people the option to look around at the camera. Yeah, I think it's really cool. I I enjoy that. Um, they be harmless. We have found the thumbnail for this episode. Yo, <laughs> we should do that. I should do that. That would be funny. They give you rabies, that's why. Yeah, that too. A lot of animals give you rabies, but bats give you diseases. <laughs> like, they give you... They give you all kinds of problems. I think that's why people are so worried, because they cause, like, really severe diseases. Let's try. Oh my god. Freaking, what's his name? There we go. Uh, my health is suffering. <laughs> Not that way. Where the hell was that thing? There should be more switches here. Hopefully. Maybe not. <laughs> run away, run away. You're too scared. Oh crap, the bat. Uh, they found the thumbnail for this episode. They give me. Oh, 
Oh, I read that. My bad. Um, where do we go? I guess I'll go that way. <clears throat> okay, now he's gone. That's good. I like how they also put in the, um, how the, like, for falls and when you're shooting, the controller vibrates now. So you can actually, you can actually tell what's happening. There it is. Let me check above this though, because this looks like. A Ooh! I knew it. I was like, this looks like they might have some kind of loot up here. I don't remember this room. What do we do here? Ooh, this looks cool though. Oh crap, the swords! I forgot about the swords. This is really cool though, how they did this. But none of them triggered. That's weird. Oh, you're right. You're right. You're right. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. <clears throat> All right. Any loot? Oh, it's only when you're coming back. Now I remember. Crap. They oh my god. I was just standing here. Oh my god, they only trigger if you pick up the key. Here we go. Here we go. Oh. Oh my god, what's happening? <laughs> thank you for letting me know. Or thank you for reminding me to save, because that would have been bad. I would have to, I would have had to go back before the Thor room, I think. Do you dive for this too? Oh, they could still hit you if you dive. Oh. <laughs> oh no, they're like going towards me too. Crap. <sighs> she literally turned into a jiggle sandwich. Oh my god. Okay, Neptune. I'm gonna go to Neptune first. Why did that bat not trigger yet? Atlas will do. We'll do Atlas first. Ooh. <gasps> no! Okay. I remember this room. There's boulders here. Cool. 
Uh, some enemies only trigger after you complete certain sections. I think that bat comes to life after you complete either Atlas or Oh, okay. That makes sense. Is this a secret? What the hell was that? Oh, that's not a secret. That's the actual key. Ooh, look at this platform I'm standing on. Okay, wait. Look how cool that looks. With all the little ornate things on it. Look at the freaking iron fence. The rusty iron. That looks so cool. Even this fence. Everything's so pretty. Imagine there was like a med kit up there. I would be like, um, or something up there. Just to like troll you. It feels like you could lose any texture in the game as a Oh, use any texture in the game as a wallpaper now. Yeah, it's really pretty. Like, everything's just, like, super nice. Use, not lose. Yeah, I got you. <laughs> I figured that's what you meant. Um, Neptune. Where's Neptune? I know it's, like, one of the top levels. There we go. Is Neptune- how many keys are there? One, two, three, I got. I think there were four rooms, right? Is the cistern next? I don't like the cistern. I feel like I don't remember all those tricks. Like, look at this texture. That looks really cool. Oh, crap. Oh. Looks really cool. The key, it's the key. Pick up the key. Yes. Can I make it though? Oh, four? Okay, cool. I'll see him next, then Talus Midas, then this. Oh, okay. Okay, I remember that one too. Progress. Imagine I died <laughs> after saying progress. <clears throat> Is that a lion? Where are the lions?
there's two of them. They sound like mountain lions when they die. Everything just looks so nice. Like, even the wall. Three med kits. <laughs> we found no secrets, damn. 